with their feud as bitter as ever, it's unlikely that Prince William and Prince Harry will come together this Christmas, but that doesn't mean ties have been completely severed. The last festive period the brothers spent together along with their wives the Princess of Wales and Duchess of Sussex was five years ago, back in 2018, and a lot has changed in that time. The Sussexes now live in California and have two children, Prince Archie and Princess Lilibet. But since leaving the UK, the couple have made several explosive claims about their time in the royal family. Speaking in their bombshell Netflix docuseries, Harry hit out at his brother and claimed the Prince of Wales screamed and shouted at him during the infamous Sandringham summit. Harry claimed the encounter left him terrified. He also detailed an incident in his memoir Spare, where he also claimed his brother attacked him after a heated argument at Kensington Palace. However, despite the tension and the two couples being on non-speaking terms, it has been reported that they both keep up one sweet Christmas tradition, according to the Sunday Times, they both exchange gifts for each other's children. The publication claims that William and Kate sent gifts across the Atlantic for Archie and Lilibet while Harry and Meghan reciprocated and bought presents for Prince George, Princess Charlotte and Prince Louis. Sunday Times royal editor Roy Nikha also revealed the tradition last year, and wrote, Believe it or not, the Waleses and the Sussexes are exchanging Christmas gifts this year. In the absence of goodwill between the couples, William and Kate will not deprive Archie and Lilibet of a present under the tree. And in one royal tradition that Team Sussex is still on board with, Harry and Meghan have also dispatched gifts for George, Charlotte, and Louis. There will be no presents exchanged between the adults. It comes as a royal expert has said that William won't be upset if Harry misses another royal Christmas due to their bitter rift. Reports have now suggested that Harry and wife Meghan Markle would be keen to accept an invitation to spend the festive period with the rest of the royal family at Sandringham this year. It comes as relations have seemingly begun to thaw between the Duke of Sussex and the King after they shared a warm phone call last week. But it seems royal insiders have poured cold water on the Sussexes and their children Prince Archie and Princess Lilibet visiting for the festive period, saying it is likely they wouldn't be welcomed back into the royal fold. And according to royal expert and former BBC royal correspondent Jenny Bond, this would please William. She told the son, little Archie and Lilibet should be running around with their many cousins, pulling crackers, opening presents and understanding their place in the family, connecting with their relatives even though their lives are thousands of miles away. But that's not going to happen. I don't think William will be shedding a tear over this. Deep down, I'm sure he still loves Harry, but I don't think he can see a way out of the rift that has opened between them. I think William has closed his mind to the prospect of reconciliation with Harry, and I can't see a time when Meghan would be welcomed back into the bosom of the family, or a time when she would ever want to be welcomed back. I doubt that William thinks about them for more than a fleeting moment, and then he probably tries to blank out those thoughts. Mm -hmm.